A suburban woman with cerebral palsy now cannot do enough for the people who helped give her independence. ABC 7's Karen Meyer joins us with her story. Karen? Sophia Linda, 25-year-old Amy Lee, started at DuPage Easter Steel in 2001 as a volunteer after spending her life getting services from them. Recently, her world has expanded. She's a new employee at the organization. On a snowy winter day, tramp the snow deep on the ground. I love reading the kids' books and seeing how they react to me, and I love hearing them call me Miss Amy. Do pay these the stairs, this Amy's home away from home. Hi, babies. She started when she was five months old. Because of her success, she only wanted to give back. Amy's a fantastic worker. It's not only working with um, a volunteer, but it's like working with one of my best friends. Melissa Jimenez is the lean inclusion preschool teacher at Easter Steel. Her class has children with and without disability from ages two and a half to four years old. I think um, being an inclusive classroom, number one, helps because they get to see children with a disability, but then they get to see what it's like when um, an adult has a disability. When not volunteering in the classroom, Amy goes to her paying job. I um, work about 15 hours a week. I um, in the fundraising department. I research donors on the computer and do a lot of public speaking in the communities. Amy's relationship with these sisters got her twin sister Kelly involved. It's really nice to get to work with Amy on a daily basis and just to be in an environment where you can see the direct effects of your work right in front of you. It, it's been really nice. I'll be working here as long as they take me. You are my sunshine. My only. Hopefully I'll, impl I'll be able to touch a lot more people than kids' lives um, in many years to come. To learn more about two pages to steal and Amy's work, go to our website, abc7chicago.com. It's a wonderful girl. Very nice. Great